Hello everybody, we are here at the John Wayne Airport in Orange County and we are getting ready to fly out on Southwest for our trip out to Austin doing a Texas road trip here so come along and join us for the adventure and we'll see how it goes on this first part of our Texas road trip which is just getting to Austin masks are still required in the airport so that's part of it turning the camera over here nothing big deal here in Orange County the John Wayne Airport pretty much all your standard stores we're going out to Terminal 20, which is at the end of the row to Southwest. Cool art displays out here. Kind of Native American influence is what it looks like to me, but they're kind of cool. Almost to our gate here. Okay, it's boarding time. We were B37 through nine. So I don't think we'll get a seat together, but we'll see what happens. We got lucky. Even though we were in the back of the bees, we still got to sit together. So that's good. What? Can you pick that up, Adrian? Okay. Reach down. It's a half a seat up. There we go. Almost done with boarding. And here we go. We made it here to the Austin airport. And there's some kind of ship thing up on the wall and some space stuff. Some massage chairs that normally would be open, but they're not. here in Austin at the state capitol building we decided to come here first looks like we're supposed to enter over there because we wanted to get here before it closed yep so you know you're in Texas when the first monument you encounter is a confederate states monument it's dedicated to Jefferson Davis. So that's what we're seeing here. We're just going to keep on going. So at the entrance here it says this gun was used for the Texan Revolution and the Civil War. Oh, so that's what they're calling it. Calling the Civil War a revolution. Interesting. <laughs> it's only a revolution if you win. <laughs> Over here is the um, state treasury building room. And we're coming into the dome. Let's see what's in the dome. Smells minty fresh in here. Oh, there's the Lone Star. Yep. Let's see what we can see on the second floor. So we're going to the House of Representatives over here. 
according to the little folder that they gave us, says that the capital was established in 1839 and the capital building was completed in 1853. <laughs> yeah. Well, what the heck is up with On the walls here we have the governor's portraits right behind the governor's reception room. And then down here we have the symbol, and you have all the different republics. Well, all the different nations it was under. Yes, you have Spain, Mexico, France. I what wonder was where the heck France was. Like that looks like, oh, the old republic is what that is, for when it was its own country and then the United States. Yeah, but yeah. I'm still questioning France. Yeah, they were part of France. Part of it was. Oh, yeah, um, and, yeah, it was part of the Louisiana Purchase. Okay, we're gonna okay. head over this way to the Senate chambers. And behind me, you have a big, here, it's like a big battle. What does it say on it, AJ? Uh, oh, the I'm Battle sure of San Jacinto. So this was the- This is when Texas. Texas. Rebelled. Yeah, rebelled. So that's what this is here. It was recognized as a legitimate country by Mexico, but with much smaller borders than what it claimed. Of course. <laughs> Beautiful building. We climbed to the third floor, and we're in the Supreme Court area. They're closed right now, but we have a little picture here. So you can see what it used to look like here. And over there is the Court of Appeals. I decided to take the elevator to the fourth floor. Nice elevator. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, very nice elevator. Fourth floor. A lot quieter up here. Let's see what's over this way. It goes up even farther, AJ, but you can't go. It's blocked off. Uh, no. My guess I is it would go to the top of the dome. Well, nothing on this side here. Let's go over here. Get a good view of the dome from up here, though. Really up high to the dome here. We're down in the underground part right now by the auditorium, and over here is the gift shop. Nice. Yeah, I see it. Okay. We are back outside. Looking for Denise out here. I think we're walking towards Congress Street. Not exactly sure. Um, we'll see what kind of monuments are out here. It's a little bit muggy. It's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Definitely muggy. So, we've got a monument here. What does it say over there? Heroes of the Alamo monument over there. And then what's over here? Some guy on a horse. Who's on a horse, AJ? Commemoration of the 8th Calvary. Okay, there you go. Got some fountains going on here. Um, you got Texas of African American History Memorial down below there. I see some oxen over there. Lots of stuff to see, I guess. I think I see Denise sitting on a bench. Yeah, some more monuments. What are the monuments, AJ? Uh, this is a memorial. This over here is a memorial. 
died for states' rights guaranteed under the Constitution. Oh, that's a Confederate, yep. Volunteer fireman. Okay, I like that. I like the volunteer fireman. Like that. Yeah. Yeah. One thing that was cool about this Chipotle is that they had aguas frescos over there, so I got myself some hibiscus lemonade, and so now I'm gonna have my... We are waiting for a lift. We're here by the Paramount show, and they're filming um, South by Southwest presents new voices program. So we're standing where we're supposed to be for our ride pickup. But it's filled with trucks right now for filming. That's what all this is all about. It's crazy. 275 for gas on credit, 265 with cash. Exxon card is 265. That is just crazy cheap gas. We are here checking into the Motel 8. The Super 8, sorry. Super 8 here in Austin. And they have breakfast, which we'll do tomorrow morning. They got a pool, and that's pretty good. We are here, the Super 8, the rooms are okay, have a comfy bed, have a TV, microwave, little mini fridge, view to nothing out there, but that's okay, air conditioning, and a standard bathroom, so it's pretty good. That's what we're getting here for our $150 weekend here.